Well, hello and happy Keep Fit Friday. Don't forget to drop me a like in down below or a thumbs up or smiley face in the comments. Let me know you're doing okay out there. I'd appreciate it on this wonderfully sunny Keep Fit Friday day. Um, I'm wearing a vest, so I'm going to have to speak up a little bit. So, the title of this video is Are You Willing? Now, as you can tell, if you watch these videos regularly, I have been talking a lot about this obesity thing all week and the uh, the revelations, particularly here in the UK, that obesity is actually a problem. Um, and sometimes when I talk about this, because I've been obese, it's people get the wrong end of the stick and they think that, um, you know, I've, I've got a sort of a lack of empathy for people and I'm quite brash. It's not that. It's not that. It's what we need to... He's had to think about this, and this is where we got to. And this is why the title of the video is "Are You Willing?" Because we've got to start off with a base of personal responsibility. We have to start there. If you don't start there, you're never going to succeed. Because if you don't start with this belief that you can control certain parts of this process, you're always going to struggle. Because if you don't feel you can control it, well, who's going to control it for you? Who's going to come along and control it for you? Nobody else is going to do it for you. Now you've got the right for help and you've got the you know, so you've got the right to get help and you should have the uh, ability to get help and the facilities to get help and I'll talk about that in a minute but ultimately it's got to start with you and it's got to start with you saying yes I am responsible for this thing that's number one once we've done that though once we've established that you know we can control certain things and can't control others as an industry a fitness industry particularly our, from our my point of view and what we do we've got a responsibility to give you the best chance possible of changing your circumstances. Like for example, there was an article yesterday about the obesity strategy and they didn't mention gyms. And the reason why they didn't mention gyms is because a lot of gyms are not welcoming places for obese people. Because a lot of them, which is what they do and that's fine, they wanna help everyone. Now, if you're an obese 45 year old woman or an overweight, even an overweight 45 year old woman who's self-conscious and you walk into a gym and you face with a bunch of 21 year old lads training their arms, that's going to be intimidating. Now, there's nothing wrong with the lads training their arms. There's nothing wrong with you going to the gym, but you can see there's a disconnect there. So the fitness industry needs to work harder at giving you the, the, the tools and the facilities and the ability to change. You've got to decide to change. You've got to be willing to change. But if you are, it's our responsibility to help you do that. And that's the difference. We should be saying to you, okay, here's how you do this here's a way to do this here's how you walk up the stairway one step at a time versus these motivational posters and slogans and treating everybody the same beast mode and all this sort of stuff that's got its place if that's what you want but that's for athletes that's for people who love training and if you're overweight you don't love training or if you're fat you don't clearly love exercise or if you do you're fat and fit which isn't really that much of an issue really so the key message is this number one you have to be willing to change you have to take responsibility for your own actions and understand what you can control secondly our responsibility is to provide you with the right resources and tools if you're willing to change to help you do that and that's where we come in so the reason why we train women 30 to 50 in our group program which of course comment 28 days if you want any details on that um, is because we want to help a certain type of person so it's clear so you're not going to turn up and there's going to be a 21 year old bloke there or a 21 year old girl there or somebody who wants to get burped into the next millennium yeah you're going to turn up and there's going to be people there like you so it's a bit more welcoming of course all these things are challenging they're supposed to be it's different it's, you're going to be uncomfortable you can never be uncomfortable in, you can never be sorry comfortable in the change process but it's being comfortable in your discomfort particularly at the start because that's what matters so that's the difference number one personal responsibility understand that learn the difference between what you can control and you can't control number two once you've done that our responsibility is to give you the, you know the opportunities to change but you've got to decide first that you want to change and if you are in that place and you do want to change get in touch drop me a comment drop me a dm um or comment with 28 days if you're interested in our women only fitness program in birmingham age 30 to 50 comment down below with 28 days we'll see if we can help uh, but as always if you appreciate these videos just drop us a like in drop us a comment in with your thoughts a share would be great or tag anybody in that you feel this video might help. Happy Keep It Friday.